Hi. Um, one of the questions that I am seeing online uh, recently um, related to Alberta's accelerated tech pathway pilot is there are two specific terms and lists that are used in this uh, particular pilot. So first is a list of NOCs, right? So NOCs, uh, any, anybody who has created an express entry profile is aware uh, what is an NOC. So NOC is basically a code for your job uh, that you created under uh, express entry profile. So for this tech gateway, you need already need an express entry profile with the minimum points of 300 and you intend to live and work in Alberta, right? But just working and living is not important. For this tech gateway, what's important is your occupation should be in the list of eligible tech pathway occupations and it's not an or it's and your employer should be part of the any ICS codes okay so if you click here you will see a list of all the NOCs that are available in the tech gateway okay so this is only the accelerated tech pathway okay so this is a list this is a two page one and a half page list which has a very small number of NOCs, right? NOCs usually runs in hundreds, but this has a very specific list of NOCs that uh, that is applicable under this gateway, right? So first step is check your express entry profile and check whether your NOC, the profile, the NOC that you used in your express entry profile is available in this list. If it's available in this list, you are good to uh, go and express your interest if not then you will have to wait if Alberta sends you a NOI based on the general express entry program that it has and the next step is also to check the list of the NA NAICS code okay? now this is not a list so if you see under NAICS right so this is again a small list this is just a one page document and this is a code that is given to all North American companies okay so your company if it's working in North America not just Canada North America America US Mexico any North American company will have a four digit codes assigned to it this is basically understand it like a like a industry vertical right in which industry the uh, uh, the company is working right so each company has one code any ICS something like so it has a general so in this page if you click on NACIS link here for Alberta you get a list of any any ICS which Alberta is accepting under the new tech pathway and under this there is one more list if you click here if you go to this link you will see the general NAICS site. So this is again, it takes you to an external site. And what this does is, is just is a generic NAICS code. So here you can search for your company, company's NAICS code, or what I would suggest is just Google your NAICS. Like for example, I normally do something like IBM, like say for example, I'm searching for um, IBM's NAICS. So I just go IBM NAICS. I just do this and here I get the NAICS code of IBM right so here you see the NAICS code is normally a six digit number say 33111 334111 but what is relevant is 3341 okay now if you are working if you click here so if you see 3341 is here right 3341 is here so for example if you have an offer from IBM to work in Alberta you should be good because the NAICS code matches the list. So this two checks is I've seen many people uh, getting confused. This is not a very difficult step. Each North American company usually has a NAICS code and this is not just an IT company. You see here it's right from electric power distribution to motion pictures to satellite to telecommunications and software, right? aerospace everything is here right so most of the companies so this is not a exhaustive list obviously this is this has around 20 25 um, 
any ICS course only. But if your company is following in in any of these categories, you have a very good chance of getting an NOI because you can express your interest, right? So the first step is kind of knocking on the door of AINP and saying, hey, I think I I I have an NOC code that you want. I and I work for a company that you want. So can you check my profile and and let me know if I can apply for your PNP. So this tech pathway is basically as it sounds is an accelerated way of getting your PNP nominations and uh, and making your uh, PR dreams come true. Okay. So this video I just wanted to concentrate on differences between NOC and NAICS. I have some more videos on how to create an expression of interest, right? And what's the difference between a tech car pathway and a, and a general pathway. So you can have a look at those videos also. And um, if you have any questions, post your questions in the comments and I'll be more than happy to help. Thank you and all the best.